Year's <laughs> inaugural Neighbor Day, nearly 40 communities across Calgary came together for barbecues, cleanups, potlucks to meet their neighbors and celebrate where they live. And on Saturday, we're going to do it all again. Neighbor Day, which will now be an annual event in Calgary, is a chance for people to honor the resilience and the community spirit that pulled our city together during the 2013 floods and the cleanup, of course. Here this morning with a preview of this year's celebration, Mayor Naya Benchy, thank you so much for coming in. And you have... I have something no one Some can have. Things. Isn't that nice? Yeah. Oh, so we have these Neighbor Day play kits that we had made available for free uh, for people throughout the community. Guess what? They're sold out. Um, <laughs> so you can have one, but I'm just going to show you what you can have. Yeah. Starting with a super cool City of Calgary beach ball. Very Everybody cool. loves beach ball. The idea yeah. here is there's all kinds of fun things in here. There's bubbles. Whoa, that's oh, a, I don't know if we should do those on live TV. Bubbles. There's sidewalk chalk, you know, um, but the, the idea here, of course, is that Neighbor Day is about doing simple things in your neighborhood. And I encourage people, even if you haven't organized anything yet, it's probably a little late for a block party permit, mm -hmm. but to just get together with your neighbors. Have a barbecue, have it on your front lawn instead of your backyard, and invite your neighbors over. Uh, it's a wonderful way to get to know your neighbors. Also a wonderful way, as you said, to demonstrate the resilience of our community, which is all based on looking after one another. There are probably any number of ways you could mark uh, the occasion of the floods and the, the cleanups thereafter. Why did Neighbor Day strike you as the right way to do that? You know, last year on the one year anniversary of the floods, we had a very serious commemoration of the mm -hmm. floods on the Friday uh, at City Hall. But on the Saturday, I said, we want to celebrate. Mm -hmm. And a lot of folks said to me, why would we celebrate such a horrible thing? And I said, what we're doing is we're celebrating how we showed the world who we are, how we right. came together afterwards. And so Neighbor Day happened across the city. You saw some, pic some pictures there. I think I had 18 or 19 <laughs> events starting first thing in the morning and ending, I remember, with the longest day of play because it was also the summer solstice right. uh, in the community of Haysboro. Uh, and they were in flood-impacted communities, non-flood-impacted communities everywhere. Some people painted fences. Some people did cleanup. Some people just had a great barbecue. But I'll tell you my favorite one in the community of Highland Park in the Northwest not flood impacted at all, high ground. They had a very simple thing. They invited everyone to their community hall, and in their community hall, they had a whiteboard. And on the whiteboard, it was split in two, and it said, I need, I can. Hmm. So you're supposed to write what you were looking for, and you're supposed to write what you could help with. And I remember one older lady wrote, I need someone who knows how to fix the lawn mower. Okay. And I asked her about it, and she said, well, I've just lost my husband. He always used to mow the lawn. And I'm happy to do it, but the, I can't start the lawn mower. It's broken. And of course, on the other side, someone wrote, I can mow your lawn. Aww. That's nice. And those are the sorts of things I think really build community. And you know, the Calgary police were handing out little magnets for your fridge, which only were to write down the name and phone number of your four closest neighbors. Right. These things really make a difference. They're tiny, but they make a difference in helping people live in neighborhoods, helping people feel like they belong. And, and, and it's kind of like a cyclical thing, right, Mr. Mayor? Because if, if the parents organize the barbecue on the front lawn or board, boards that say, you know, I, can't, I need and I can, that type of thing, then the kids see that. Mm -hmm. And the next generation says growing up, and it just kind of keeps rolling and rolling. Right? Absolutely. One of my favorite things is to see little kids doing these little acts of community service, right? And particularly on those communities that chose to do a cleanup or a fence painting, you see these tiny children doing this, <laughs> and you know maybe they're not a great painter but they're starting a lifetime habit of community service and I think that's awesome. Yeah. Do you have a sense, I mean I, I know you have a sense of the number of stops you'll be on uh, on Saturday, but do you have a sense of your itinerary and the variety of activities? Yeah, I sure do uh, and it really is all over the place. I love block parties. Long before the flood I had this idea that we should have a one day for citywide block parties and my colleagues in the roads department were like, how many barriers do you think we have? <laughs> right. And I said, people can put lawn chairs, it's fine, it'll work. Um, um, and so a ton of those, I'm going to be all over the city. There's a couple of big ones um, that are, of course, in flood impacted mm -hmm. neighborhoods that are still commemorating that in places like Elbow Park and uh, Cliff Bungalow Mission and Rideau. But I'm going to be in every corner of the city. And I tried to go to neighborhoods that I haven't been to before. So I'm spending a lot of time in deep southeast Calgary where I didn't go last Neighbor Day. Uh, it's going to be great. Is, how can somebody invite you if they want you to come by? <laughs> so, well, uh, it's a little late now. Is it? Oh, you guys are in. But, okay. but I actually did say, yeah. you know, if you're having a great event, invite me. I'll yeah. show up. Uh, you may or may not want me to show up, but I'll show up. Uh, so 
calgarymayor.ca, there's a little invitation form, and yeah. that works year-round. If you're ever doing anything great in the community, I, that's what I do on my weekends. I go out where volunteers are doing great things in the community. And always fun to tweet you to see if you reach out. Yeah. I was very social media savvy. Mayor uh, Nathed Nenshi, thank you so much for thank joining you. us today. Beach ball? I can beach ball. Always, <laughs> love the I beach ball. I only have about 17 of these at home. My daughter <laughs> seems to collect them. Yeah, Over today to will. Exactly. There Nicely you go. Nicely done. Yeah. A literal <laughs> talk.